More than 150 laid off Navistar workers marched to City Hall last night with a message. We need government help, and that starts with the municipality. Laid off employee Richard Cowden says the last year's been pretty hard. When he got laid off, uh, unemployment only lasted a little while, eh? and then money just disappears. And the way this company's treating us, it's unbelievable. CAW Local 127 President Aaron Neves spoke to Blackburn Radio just before the march. The, hard, the harsh reality is yeah. we can't bargain ourselves out of the, what the, the position we're in today. Nothing we can do at the bargaining table. We need government, provincial and federal intervention here. You know, this, this is a repeat of 1958 all over again when the automotive industry was in dismal dis, you know, disrepair. And for lack of better words, government intervened uh, under, under uh, the, the, the uh, auto pack at the time. And uh, we've seen prosperity. Ingersoll today is probably the best example of what manufacturing does in your community. They're, they're on the verge of an economic boom. And if you want to get out of the unionized environment, let's talk about Woodstock. What Woodstock has done, right? With the, with the, with the, they're building the hospital in Woodstock. Why? Because it's all directly related to manufacturing. So manufacturing matters. We need our, 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 our we're asking council tonight is to clearly support our initiative like they did back in November of 08. We brought the Made in Canada Matters forward. If we get intervention on, on, on there, we feel we have a chance. But, I mean, the harsh reality is, um, here's an employer that's basically uh, mandated and, and, and they're, they're just chastising um, with what's going on with the, uh, with the free trade. Free trade doesn't work. It's obvious. It's clear.